phone at this time, but if you leave your name and a number, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. At the beep. We went too far, Jack. This could end up landing us in jail. There's no liability on our part for what happened. We were just in the right place at the right time. That guy is dead, Jack. And we made it happen. Don't be absurd, Michael. We just pushed the story in a certain direction. It was his own fault he got in that bloody mess. We were just sitting around waiting for something exciting to happen. And we got the money shot. You crazy, Jack? We have gone far beyond what we agreed to do, and now people are dying. I can't be a part of this project any longer. Too many corners are getting cut. I can't do this any longer, Jack. We should have done things the old-fashioned way. Everyone's doing it the old-fashioned way. That's what makes what we're doing so unique. Unscripted events unfolding before our lens by people who are completely oblivious to what's going on. You can't teach real emotion, Michael. And if we have to bump them in a certain direction to create a story that our viewers want to see, what's the problem? The problem is people are dying. Every story has a beginning, a middle, and an ending. We script the middle and leave the ending up to fate. The beginning is really redundant. We follow our cast into a story they themselves don't have a clue what's going on. Only the people on the webcast know the plot, and it's working out way better than we expected. Last week alone we had over two million hits. Yeah, but Russell died! Russell made a bad decision which ended up him leaving the scene in a body bag. But his death made you a quarter of a million dollars. No, I'm done. I'm out of this. Goodbye, Jack. Hey, I'll need the disc, Michael. That disc is my only protection. If one more person dies, I'm turning it over to the feds. You had a lead role here, Michael. Over, it's Jack. groundbreaking. It's over. Goodbye, Jack. No, Michael, it's not over. It's just the beginning. Hey, it seems Mr. Powers wants out of the project. I see a promotional opportunity here for you. Okay. Yes, I'm heading to New York this morning. My flight leaves in about three hours. I'll call you when I get settled in, okay? Love you too. Bye. What the? Can't thank you enough for the promotion, Michael.
pretty thing like you doing drinking alone. I'm not drinking alone. I'm here to meet with him. What would you want to meet with him for? You got me right here. What makes you so special? I'm sure something here sparks some interest. Well, as a matter of fact... Ah! Oh, God damn it! You always did have a flair for the dramatics. He was not on the body, or in his apartment either. We did find that he was staying at some small motel, but it wasn't there either. We did find a message on his cell phone that leads us to believe that he handed it off to somebody. Hi Michael, it's Lucy Starks. Yes, I did get the audio video for that new musical. I have yet to sit and watch it though, but I will do as soon as I get the chance. Thanks for everything. I told my dad he owes you a few drinks next time you two get together. If it's successful, I do expect my proper cut, though. Find this girl, get me that tape, and make sure she gets her proper cut. I am Michael Powers. If you are watching this disc, I may be in trouble. Jack Action Films is experimenting with a new filming technique called Invisible Scripts, which I feel has cost an innocent man his life. This web audition disc will tell you everything you need to know, and it needs to be taken to the authorities now. Cameras are everywhere. And I fear this disc may have put you at risk. This disc cannot be taken back to Jack Action, as I feel it's the only thing keeping me alive. At first, it was seemingly harmless, but Jack has extended his taste for reality, and he has deliberately set the stage for unsuspecting people to fulfill his storylines. Dangerous storylines, with deadly outcomes. Time is running out, as I fear he has already planned another web episode to air soon. The site at silvermoonstudios.org streamlines the live action to let the viewers know what is happening, usually with footnotes at the bottom, doctored up to some degree for the viewer's interest. Forward this disc to the authorities now, before someone else dies for viewer entertainment.
She saw us coming. She won't get far. Yeah. Yeah, the girl got away. She's got the disc. Tracker, project her moves, finish this chapter. But make it look good. Cameras are rolling. She's now portraying a secret agent, carrying a disc full of classified information she's gonna sell off to the terrorists. Make it quick. And get me that fucking disc! You all right? Yeah. Sorry, everything is fine. It's just my boyfriend's a little drunk and disorderly right now, and I'll just be going. Well, if you want to come in the house and wait it out until he calms down, maybe call somebody. Yeah. Sure. Thanks. Now, you want to tell me what's really going on? I don't think that was your boyfriend. You're holding on to that disc like it's a million dollar bill. And your arm's obviously hurt. Let's get something for that. No, it's not my boyfriend. It's just, I don't know exactly what's going on, but I think those guys are after this disc. Do you have a DVD player? Yeah, it's over by the TV. How about the internet? What happened to your eye? Oh, don't worry about my eye. Got in a little bar fight today. This really huge guy decided to use my eye for a bottle opener. Oh, that's too bad. Well, this is crazy. It says here that you're a CIA operative with a stolen disc and you're going to sell it to terrorists. <laughs> that's awesome. Can I be your partner? <laughs> this is serious. Their orders are to shoot to kill, and I'm not sure I want to let that happen. So what do you want to do now? You want to call the police? Well, that's odd. I gotta get this disc to the cops without making my way back onto their little stage. Oh, look it. There they are again. How'd they do that? That's us. They hijacked my webcam. We gotta get out of here. Oh. Now! Oh. Come on! Hold on. I got something that might help. You're gonna play a badass CIA agent. Better have a gun. Come on. Eyes out for surveillance cameras. I bet that's how they track their people. Just like your webcam. Hackers and filmmakers working together. Kind of like the teachers' union and politicians hoping to host a family barbecue. I can't believe you have a sense of humor at a time like this. Well, it's live on the internet. They're not going to kill off the main character. You can't let the bad guys win. Maybe what our country does at times seems unethical, but it's for the betterment of our country. And you're selling our secrets to our enemies. I am not an agent, and this is not some sort of classified information. 
This is evidence that can send you to jail. You're killing real people in these web movies. Movies? You've been misinformed, Agent Starks. That's a government disc, and it must be returned. I don't know what part I play in all this, but where's the cameras? What cameras? All we have are pissed off government officials. Remember me, bitch? Oh my god! No! No! This isn't happening! This isn't happening! This isn't happening! The disc missed. No, starts. this isn't happening. Let's go for a gun. She was an excellent agent. It was a shame she turned on us. I'll notify our next of kin. There'll be no mention of any disc in my report. What disc? Movie's over, Jack.